Hello everyone and welcome back to another match. This time, I am hunting some survivors down as the weakest killer in the game, Wraith. Because guess what, I have a Wraith daily and I just want to get it done. So I just have a reappearance and disappearance sped up on my bell. And look, someone is my object of obsession. They probably have decisive strike as well, but let's see if anyone spawned over here. So we got a Dwight, he's a little Mimi. And he likes to teabag. You're really good at pressing that control button, buddy. But let's go find someone on the gens, because I need to apply gen pressure, not chase around people who know how to pallet loop. Yeah, that person's gonna like know where I am all the time. So let's find the generators. Gotta keep the gen pressure up. So I know two people ha are not doing them because they were running around. But they'll probably be on one soon. Here we are. The favorite place to be as killer. And we got a Meg. Yep. Nope. No window for you. See right there? Expert body blocking. A good race knows how to body block survivors and then... They get super confused and don't know what to do, like this Meg. Okay, she throws it out looking, and she tries to blind at pallets. That worked out really well for you, didn't it? That's right, I got brutal strength. You're not gonna blind me. Oh, hey Dwight. Thanks for the uh, free brutality and hunting points. He might have dead hard, so I'm not gonna try and hit him again. Then, okay, so two people on that gen, and Dwight is probably going to save as soon as I leave. But if I can get them off this gen, that will be okay. She's already gone. No commitment at all to this generator. They're just gone. Okay, we'll get Nia, or... Yeah, that's the sprint burst. Let's get Nia, because she just fast vaulted when I wasn't chasing her. So uh, thanks for that, Nia. Oh, there's no pallets over here. What are you going to do? Go down, that's what. <laughs> okay, another barbecue stack. So far, so good. Only one generator done. They're blowing up stuff over there. What do we got? Okay, they're working on that. And I'm pretty sure my object of obsession person is still over here. So, that object of obsession, Meg, will know where I am all the time because of my cloak. I just want to make sure she's not here. I know for sure they're probably going to pop that generator before I can get to them at this point because I waited too long. But maybe I can catch one of them as they walk away from the gen. Or maybe they won't finish it. Well, but here you are. I thought there was another person on there. Rip. I get this guy. Oh, nice play there. This is a super safe palette, as you could tell. <laughs> but all for those on hook hits. Okay, well, this is not going well. But at least he throws pallets super fast. Thank you, buddy. Thank you very much for getting rid of these two pallets here to make the area more dangerous for your friends. And you didn't even stun me. So it wasn't even worth. Okay, they're probably going to finish this gen next because it was so close. Okay, she's running to Killer Shack. Of course, when I'm playing Wraith, I get someone who's running Object of Obsession. Of, of all the times, this is the only time I've played Wraith all day, and it's the first time I get someone with Object of Obsession. Okay, that person is running towards Barn still. I think they may have... Yep. Cycled back. 
A lot of people, when they realize they're not being chased by the killer, will return to the generator they are working on. And I just gotta try and apply some gen pressure here. Lucky for me, this Meg gets predicted easily. <laughs> um, so I'm just gonna make sure they're not finishing this gen before I pick her up. Because when I pick her up, I will lose all the pressure. And poor little Wraith does not have good map pressure. Okay, they're going to finish that generator by the time I hook this Meg. She crawled away, and there she is. So now I gotta patrol these two generators because I know for a fact that one nearby is almost done. So they might be aggressively on it. Okay, so they're on that one still. Okay, I think they got off. Yep, that's Object of Obsession, girl. Yeah, too strong. I can't catch her. I mean, I could catch her if I really wanted to, but if I committed to chasing her, they'll get this gen finished. So I have to go back here and apply pressure. <laughs> and Dwight is not heals, because uh, that's what you do when you have an injured teammate. You do not heal them, you commit to the generator. Got the pro plays here. And there we go, third stack. Okay, so yeah. They're probably going to finish that gen in the corner really soon. And there's someone down here. Yeah. See, I don't really want to chase through the barn because I know they can use the barn really effectively. And Wraith, especially Wraith, is so weak against that. So I'm just going to try and patrol this hook and these two gens, even though I know the gen in the corner will be popping. G good strategy. <laughs> So now I have to commit to chasing him because I wasn't able to down him there. Cause what else am I supposed to do? I could go to the gates, but they're definitely gonna get one open and I won't I don't think I'll be able to down someone before either gate is open. So I have to chase this guy. And now is the fun times. These are the times where survivors create the salt in the after game chat of a camper killer, uh, get good, please. But I'm a wraith. Okay. So everyone's coming for the save. So we gotta be careful because of the BT. Oh, look, there's Hatch. We'll just hit her and then they'll save, right? See, the gate here is so close, and there's still a pallet up here. So it makes it really- this is a really safe hook. Yeah, you're self-carrying. See, I know this Nia, all she's gonna do is pallet loop me and then run to the exit gate. So... And I whiff. Cause I'm bad. And then they save, okay. Well, at least they wasted the pallet. So of course we're gonna tunnel the injured guy, cause he ran in a straight line. But here's what they don't know. I'm not going to hook him yet. I still want some more blood points, so we're going to use Dwight as bait here. Hopefully, someone will misplay so we can down them. I just got to keep on them. Use nurses to see if they're healing. You don't blend in with the grass, Meg. You're not Claudette. <laughs> Okay, so someone else is here. Oh look, it's our obsession. She's probably trying to lure us away from the way she was running. Oh, hey Dwight, get farmed. Easy blood points. 
Isn't that the best feeling as a survivor when you get farmed? See, everyone knows when you see the killer coming, you 99 the heal, because you have to wait for them to swing, and then after they swing, then you pick them up, because it gives you a better chance of at least one other person getting away, and then the person doesn't feel farmed. Okay, so we got Aenea here. We'll hook her. White's gonna get healed, but that's okay, because more hook points for me. And now we go and camp this Nia. So I think they're at the other exit gate. Dwight's probably gonna get healed to full. What? Self carrying in front of the exit gate? Well, let's just push her out. Gonna use your sprint burst? Okay then. That was the most interesting sprint port. Sprint per stash to the gate I've ever seen. And uh, because of it, I'll get my fourth stack. Thank you very much, Meg, for messing up. Okay, so now they're saving the Nia. You waited a little too long for that save, Meg, because, well, I already had hooked her. And there I go whiffing again. It's after playing Hillbilly and Nurse for so long. I obviously don't have race lunge distance down. Was that a flashlight? Did you just try to blind me when I was facing objects? Well, poor Nia does not get out alive. But hey... At least I made the end game there pretty fun, right? And I'm pretty sure everyone in the game pipped. So, they all had fun. Well, thank you, Dwight. Now I can break that food brutality. No, no flashlight burning, please. So the person was in a locker here, and I uncloaked so they don't see me coming, but yep, they got out. She's probably going to try and camp the hatch, so I just want to push her out. As you see, I'm expertly mind-gaming her here. Yeah, just run to the exit, Meg. No trapdoor for you. Thanks. Goodbye. Hope you had fun. Not a bad game as Wraith, actually. I hooked a ton of people multiple times. And uh, I got my daily done too, I believe. See, look, everybody pipped. So obviously a fun game for everyone. And yep, easy. Got my daily done. Well, thank you everybody for watching. I hope you enjoyed the gameplay here of the rare and elusive uh, Wraith. I'm really excited for his buff that's coming up. Can't wait to see what the race cube brings to us. But uh, anyways, thanks again for watching. And as always, good luck out there in the fog and see you next time.